Good morning everybody. I'm literally about to go get the train and <laughs> thank goodness I started vlogging because I genuinely would have left the house with my makeup hair clips in. Wow. That would be embarrassing but it wouldn't be the first time I've <laughs> done it. I went all the way to London once with one of these like on the back to stop my little flicky bits so that was a great day. Anyway, I'm coming at you from the spare room today. It's fun having different rooms to film in. This is what everyone else is doing. I feel so fun. I was about to say I feel so cool, but nothing on this planet will actually ever make me cool. Even just saying that literally takes away any attempt at being cool that I might have ever made. Anyway, this morning I am about to head off to London. I have a really nice couple of days planned. I've been looking forward to this for I think the best part of like a month and a half. This has been booked in for a really long time. So today I have a wedding dress fitting in London with a brand that I love and have loved for a really long time. So we're going to Halfpenny and I am literally so excited. I love the really dramatic dresses. I love the combinations of like tops and skirts and how you can really like customize the dresses and all of the pieces. Literally for years, if anyone has posted like a wedding dress shopping video and said they're going to half penny, I'm, I'm there, I'm there in the first 10 minutes, I am there watching. And I have a couple of my bridesmaids coming with me for this fitting. And then I have, there's gonna be a lot of and then. And then I have an Armani dinner this evening. Tomorrow we have bridal makeup. I'm gonna leave you hanging before I tell you who the bridal makeup trial is with but I am literally it's one of my dream brands and lots of you might be able to guess if you remember like in Q&A's when I've been asked my top makeup brands I have repeatedly said this as one of my I think top three brands I could wear a full face of this brand for the rest of my life and not be sad at all literally top tier I'm so ecstatic to just be having a trial with them go away and then i have another wedding dress fitting in the evening and i'm gonna leave you hanging on that one as well because this is a brand that is very special to me and when you see why lots of you will be able to tell it's very special and i am really looking forward to going in and trying on some of their dresses <laughs> so literally i have the funnest couple of days planned i can't wait, can't wait to see my bridesmaids. I'm going to leave the bridesmaids joining me as a surprise for you guys as well. Yeah, I need to leave like right now for the station because I have chatted to you already for way too long and I have a suitcase that is almost the same size as me to get to the station because we have so many outfit changes over the next couple of days. So I'm gonna bring you along and show you what I'm wearing, what I'm doing, and I'm just so excited. It's so fun, like we finally got through the Black Friday period and I feel like I can finally breathe and start having some fun now. We've just got a few more weeks of work left of the year. Let's do it, let's do it. This is gonna be the funnest couple of days. So yeah, let's go. So I want to do an outfit of the day, but I actually don't have a mirror in this house that isn't covered in dust to show you my outfit. So we're gonna, I'm gonna do a little outfit of the day in the new bathroom. I am wearing, you've seen this outfit many times before. <laughs> this is a go-to for me. I am wearing my Jane and Tash burgundy leather jacket, which let's just call it a brown because I'm wearing a brown body and it's basically the same color. This is from Skims, my go-to for the great basics. And then I've got a pair of River Island black trousers. Let me see if I can, can you see me out here? Who knows? River Island black trousers. I'll be wearing my Veja trainers, but this is a no shoe zone up here. And then I've got a Celine belt and I'll be taking my YSL tote. And my earrings are from Monica Vinida. And I'm wearing the same ring combo that I've literally been wearing in the, far, in the past few vlogs. I have not taken these off, so I will link them in the other box if you want to see them. But anyway, let's go before I'm really late. So I've just got to London and I've checked in to our hotel room. Me and Vic are sharing. Look how cute it is. These beds are so big. Like when she said we had a room together with separate beds, I was expecting like a weird little single bed and I was like, oh, okay. No, this is so nice. So we're staying at one Mayfair. I've been here for lunch recently on my birthday for a wedding edition event with Skydomes. It was really nice. So it's good to be back. I have the world's flattest hair. I always have the worst hair when we go and do wedding dress fittings. It's really, really annoying. I don't really know how to salvage it right now. So that's good. But yeah, how nice is the bathroom? 
really nice i really like the wood it's cute uh this is the shower it looks out onto the bedroom so me and victoria can perv on each other when we're showering just kidding curtain we've got a little bathroom here wardrobes here it's just so nice such a nice big room but anyway i am going to try and salvage my hair and then i need to leave asap i've got some meeting before i have the wedding dress fitting so i need to try and do something to this but be right back <laughs> <I'm getting married. laughs> again, again. <laughs> Let me take you over there. wow oh my god so much half penny this is so fun i like everything a bit yeah. too much like, okay I love <laughs> <laughs> that's good. No, it's that's funny. Better than <laughs> not like an struggling. Being really yeah. messy. I, yeah, I just I love everything, and the more like dramatic, the better. I think. Okay, so let's start with Tide. Let's yeah. go kind of big. Oh, and, yes. and let's. Oh, should we sorry. just? Uh, with, um, what type of neck? Yeah, all the Willoughby with the sleeve. Like, do you like them off the shoulder, a strapless? Um, really, a sweetheart neckline. As much as I originally was like. Looks really nice on me. Yeah. Um, off the shoulder also looks very nice. High neck looks very nice. Long anything long sleeve looks yeah. nice. Yeah. So yeah, basically just not super straight across. I find it makes me look quite yeah. bony, and I don't know if I love. It. Okay. Well, we it's really cute. You look amazing. I love that one. Okay, we've got so many incredible ones. So we've got the big dandy live veil. Okay, right. We have something to tell you. Firstly, you're a quick slag. As when I showed this to you, you wanted to buy it the next day. Come here, pet. And then, you are quick, but you're not as quick as us. We are quicker. Just making Susie cry before she <laughs> tries on her clothes. Are we doing something big first? 
Yes. Okay. Sorry, amazing. Okay. okay. I'm trying Let's to give go it some volume. Oh, you have to do that thing where you tuck your head under that. Okay. Ready? Steady. Same. What a great neckline. Oh. With the bow. I'm screaming for the bow. <laughs> the bow. There's so much material. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Oh my god, the bow and the train! The bow and the train. Oh my god, wait, I need to take a picture. This is so cool. Christmas lights. I'm actually feeling festive this year. Yeah, me too. Hello. So I am going to catch up with you fully later because we have a lot to discuss. However, I had to get ready for dinner very quickly. We have a dinner with Armani. The girls are gulling. Wait, can you see me? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do my shoe. Victoria is having. Victoria is having a moment. <laughs> We're having a wardrobe disaster. Leg up. No. Do you want? Me? You, you've got you want Amelia's on it. Time Whilst Amelia is assisting, I thought I would show you my dress. Yes. So I'm wearing this House of CV dress. I'm hoping you can see because I can't see you. Girl needs contacts. Oh, That's, I'll tell <laughs> you. Can they see me? Yeah, they can see you. Thank you. I love how you're just assisting everyone. Thanks <laughs> of service is my love language. It <laughs> is. So I've got a House of CV dress. I've sewn Victoria's Renee's, which is not normally a shoe I would go for, but they actually looked best with the yeah. dress from the side yeah i was wearing court shoes and it just wasn't giving it was cutting me off it wasn't it wasn't looking good but this is really cute they're gold tones so they tie in really well with the new bag and we will discuss we will discuss shortly because i have a story i'll catch up with you in a bit yeah because i've tears tears anyway my earrings are from cause and then just the same rings as earlier <laughs> Anyway, I have to go. Car's outside. We gotta go. Okay, Amelia has told me I need to vlog. What is... Wow! Oh my god. Oh, We've been here before, haven't we? Yeah. For a, a thing. They wow. They do like really fancy things every year outside. Wow, cool. that's yeah. amazing. Oh my gosh, so festive! Yeah. It's so nice. I'm feeling Christmassy. <laughs> Victoria is ready for bed. Look at her. Up the corridor. She's gone. <laughs> She's leaving us. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Not me I'm wearing my stunning I Heart Barley t shirt. This t shirt I um I bought out of irony, you know? Like, I needed, I'd spilt something on myself. I needed something to wear on the flight home from Bali and this it was nice and soft i was like this will do obviously my experience in bali was not full of love so this was definitely a more ironic purchase anyway good morning it is nice and early because out at a workout class i realized i had just hadn't really spoken to you very much or caught up with you so yesterday i actually barely vlogged so we can like flash back to that right now. I had a makeup appointment with Charlotte Tilbury in the morning, had my makeup done. It was really great to meet their team. We talked bridal makeup. They did my makeup, but it won't be my, what you see won't be my bridal makeup. We actually went quite like, I felt like I should be going out with that makeup. But for the actual wedding, I'll definitely go for something different to that but it was good to just play about with products and i know what i want i also got to see some really fun things that they're bringing out next year and i can't even tell you i can't even tell you the categories it's that top secret but i'm so excited so yeah it was just it was great the makeup held up so well so that was the most important thing was really not necessarily like the overall style of the makeup it was more of a road test for longevity and how everything feels and i mean i already know that i love I'm a big big charlotte tilbury fan and the makeup held up so well i literally wore it until like 10 
o'clock at night. In the evening, I had another wedding dress appointment and i'm not really showing you a ton from these wedding dress appointments in terms of like different styles because we are at a point where it's getting serious now and i'm kind of fine tuning what i like a lot more and i just i'm going to be a little bit more top secret i think from this point onwards so yeah but i'll maybe share some little bits with you from yesterday's appointment it was just so beautiful so wednesday what day was, what day was it <laughs> wednesday we went to half penny to look at dresses and i met Kate and she's just she's just one i i absolutely love her i've always been such a big fan of her work like the second someone posts a wedding dress try on and they're at half penny i am there watching it i love how she will do like different tops and skirts and pair them together and she'll just like she is she's the creator she is the creator so she can like just stitch things onto you there and then and she's just she's so lovely as well i just got a really lovely warm vibe from her and i just i think she's such a special human being and her designs are so special and it's just it was a really really lovely afternoon i also had vic and amelia with me which just made me so happy and they i still i can't really talk about it without crying <laughs> but i can't believe they got me that olympia latin bag it's just the nicest thing bar my proposal i think anyone's ever done for me and i just now i'm gonna cry i can't i honestly i just can't they're just love them i just can't that i have no words i have no words <sighs> i just adore them it's just so so very unnecessary but so sweet and lovely of them and i just love them so much and they're just very special to me so that was it was just the nicest afternoon and then we obviously had the armani dinner but anyway back to what i was telling you about which was my wedding dress fitting from yesterday it was three hours long there were so many dresses we went to pronovius which is a brand that is very special to me and i have been a big fan of their dresses for years and I still have not made any decisions. I tried on so many dresses yesterday and I'm just, there's a lot to think about now. There is so much to think about. I have one more appointment in December. It was meant to be next week and it's just been pushed back now. So I need to, as soon as that one is over, I need to make a decision because obviously we are then coming closer to the wedding. But yeah, it would be good to know by the new year really what i want to do because then we can start planning lots of other stuff i think we can work a lot around the dress and tie in other elements of the wedding with dress design and yeah there's a lot to think about it was so fun though it was just such a lovely experience it's such a lovely store it was so big i don't know if i have vlog footage of the store but i definitely i definitely got phone footage so i'll show you a little bit of that wow bond street looking insane this evening these dresses and when you're in the atelier you can see them hand stitching the um the flowers oh my gosh. Um, it's amazing to see yeah. amazing work that they do and also like all the like embroidery details and everything that you see it's two women that are literally sitting yeah. there with the you know like the little tool and they're sewing everything by hand and doing like all the prototypes and everything it's so there's, there's mesh yeah. and then in the mesh they stitch every flower exactly. and every bead or they do like the patterns and they do like six different ones lace placements every lace is pinned on with a pin and stitched in that particular mm -hmm. way it's crazy you see hundreds yeah. of pins so what they basically do is they put like all the flowers in the right? Mm -hmm. lots of my friends are like oh i'm just going to make really quiet like the minimal the more you try you're like the more you love so yeah. the, the harder it is to choose it's so hard especially i feel like we've really doubled up here it's mm -hmm. so stunning i think when you know you know yeah do, do you think yeah i think you'll come out and you won't really have words really oh my god mm. oh, it's so nice. wow so nice yeah 
are you feeling this one compared to the rest? Completely different. I don't, I quite like a princess dress because I don't really worry about like how much I've eaten. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anything you wear will make fit like a glove. Yeah. So don't even worry about that. Mm -hmm. It has a lovely button detail, but. Oh, wow. Lovely long sleeve. Yeah, I really like the sleeves. This is so beautiful. Really nice. Is it? Also completely different to everything else you've tried. Yeah, I really, I really <laughs> will go for a range. <laughs> yeah. You need to see what you like. Yeah. And how everything looks on you, because maybe you envision one thing, but then when you put it on, like you love it, and yeah. you never thought you would. No, exactly. Okay. Oh, we have, we have hydrated. She is glowy. I need to just go home and healthy eat for like a week which is all i've been craving as a home cooked meal and i was on the phone to ryan last night and he was like so this weekend all i want is a takeaway there are two people in this world and they apparently marry each other so that's good but anyway my appointment last night did not finish until 8 p.m and i was meant to go home yesterday but i ended up staying because vic was staying at this hotel still i ended up just staying because i was so i've been standing in heels for three hours and i was very hungry and very tired and i wouldn't have got home until very late so i just decided to lie down here yeah i'm going home this morning i'm really excited to be home i can't wait to be with my dog it's gonna be the best. Can we take a moment for this Tetris? Cause I'm quite impressed with this, you know? This is what it's like <laughs> living with Victoria. <laughs> I swear these things, like she just breeds them, like they just pop off her, like a weird little thing in a game where they just sprout things and leave things behind them in like a video game. And every time I stay in a hotel room with Vic, there's always one of these like on the floor <laughs> left behind. And they're actually really useful. So Vic, if you ever need a silk scrunchie, if you ever run out and you wonder where they've all gone, don't worry, I'm collecting them for you. I'll bring them back. Good morning, everybody. So, spoiler alert, but we're back in the house. You'll see a little bit more of that in next week's vlog or the next vlog coming next week. I don't even know. I don't know when. You guys, my schedule is a lot right now. I have something in my diary every day for a long time. And I actually thought it would be fine, but I'm feeling a little bit like, wow, because I'm trying to move house at the same time. It's a lot. Anyway, I thought, I've destroyed this bag, so please ignore the spots on it, but I thought I would show you what I got at my Charlotte Tilbury appointment. I love Charlotte Tilbury makeup so much, so this is very exciting for me. So they gifted me some things. First thing is the magic cream, which I love. It's so good. It's such a nice, like, priming, moisturizing base. Oh, I've got a serum as well. That's handy for traveling. It's such a nice one to use before you're about to do like a lot of makeup on your face. It makes your base look really good. It's quite smoothing, just leaves your face looking really snatchy. I would say it's more like a makeup skincare than like a my skincare skincare is, is doing a lot for the skin, but this goes a long way for the makeup like i love it as like her putting on before i do my makeup then we have the oh i haven't used this the collagen super fusion facial oil mm. i have to say i was really happy with my makeup that they did the other day i'm normally never really impressed with people doing my makeup so i have literally the most faith in them oh this feels so nice oh it smells good mm. That's lovely. I also bought some dry shampoo when I was in London. Met a lovely viewer whilst I was buying my dry shampoo with my greasy head. Oh my God, that oil was so nice and hydrating. Love that. That's actually a really, as well as for the face, I would probably use that on people when I do nails as well. I think that would be a really lovely one. It would make your cuticles look really good. Oh my God, we have the lip oil. The lip oil is the best. I've run out of mine. I ran out of it so long ago and forgot to repurchase. It's a rollable. And it literally has, oops, I'm making a mess of this already. Oh my God. It feels so nice. And it's literally, it's got the best smell. The best, best smell. Mm. You're going to get someone a little Christmas gift. That is any, anyone that has lips will like it. So they gave me this whilst I was having my makeup done. 
the lip cheat which is just one of the best lip liners ever this is the shade iconic nude it's my go-to lots of the girlies love pillow talk but iconic nude for me is it because my lips don't look it but they're weirdly warm and whenever you put a any color any pigment on them it will make it look way warmer so for me pillow talk comes out quite purple whereas iconic nude looks like how pillow talk looks on other girls on me i also bought some armani lipsticks which i thought i'd show you because i'm obsessed with these lipsticks they did not send these to me i went out and bought them off my own back because a lot of stuff was sent to my house whilst i've been away so these have probably like turned up gone to the post office and just been sent back because i couldn't keep up with the rate at which i was needing to go to the post office i have been dying to get my hands on these since the summer they did a master class and they were talking about these oh, shade one 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 the matte lip power so nice and i also got one four four it looks like a pinkier tone so up my street oh my god i'm gonna swatch i'm gonna swatch where hang on oh my god that's so nice they have nailed it with the colors of these and i have to say that's something that luxury brands don't do often is nail the colors of nude lipsticks they have a thousand shades of red and pink and purple and every color but what they don't do what a lot of brands don't do very well is nudes nudes that are like a white based nude which just for me it really and i think for a lot of girls that are more olive actually just for a lot of girls i don't know why they don't do it, it they look good on everybody so yeah this is shade 144 this is shade 111 this is more brown this is more pink oh stunning anyway back to the charlotte tilbury i've got the pillow talk beautifying lip and cheek secrets oh we've got mini are they white are they minis are they full size oh my god i think they're full size wow that's such a good set this beauty light wand in pillow talk love mm, lip and cheek glow i don't think i've tried this i think this might be one of the last products from charlotte tilbury on this planet that i have not tried I remember when they did a limited edition one of these. It was like the Norman, what's the name? Norman something or something Norman collection. It was the limited edition. They came with like beautiful art pieces on the top. I still have mine. I refuse to give it up. It's like a bright corally pink. This is stunning. Very up my street for the winter months. I love like a mauvey pink on me. What else have we got? I have a pillow talk lipstick and I have Ooh, Pillow Talk Collagen Lip Bath. So basically, I think I've got the majority of the things that are in here also in this. Ooh. Oh, that's so nice. Mmm. Oh, it's like a little bit minty as well, so I think it's going to be a bit plumping, which I love. Yes, give me all the plumping. And then we have Push Up Lashes, which is one of my favourite mascaras. It's, it is so good. It's very similar to the Swede Lashes Cloud Mascara that I've been using a lot lately. Like, very buildable very thickening volumizing love that okay if you're in the uk drop me a dm i will pick one of you randomly and i will send this to you because i have a lot of doubles here please give me time to send it to you like it might not make it to you before christmas but i will <laughs> pick one of you and send it it might not be pronto because i'm actually i don't life at the moment is a lot but one of you will get this if you're watching this the day it goes live before what time will i upload this before 9 p.m drop me a dm so wednesday wednesday the 29th uk time obviously before 9 p.m drop me a dm i will pick one of you if you if you dm me and spam me and fill up my inbox after 9 p.m i'll cry <laughs> no one's ever getting a message back ever 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 again but yeah if you're watching this in like basically the first couple of hours that this video goes live and you're from the uk you have to have a uk address drop me a dm and I will pick one of you. Secret giveaway. I've never done one of those before. I like this. I like doing it in the first few hours that it goes live. I know for some of you, you just are busy, but I feel like that's a nice way of doing it. Like all of you that are just here with me in the first like few hours it goes live. That's so cute. I'm excited. So yeah, that is what I got gifted from Charlotte Tilbury. I'm really happy with this lip combo, that Armani lip and the charlotte tilbury pillow talk lip collagen that is a good lip combo i'm very very happy with that anyway what a week i honestly i can't believe that the girls got me that bag it's honestly so sweet of them so over the moon and so touched and just so like it's so funny my brain my anxious little brain 
never really believes that people like me that much and i know gifting is doesn't necessarily equate to love but like i just my anxious little brain sometimes is like questions i just realized my wall is really not straight wow like sometimes my anxious little brain is just like constantly questioning whether people actually like me or like am i too annoying or am i this or am i that and i just was like so overwhelmed it was the best i feel like i'm gonna cry again <laughs> it was just so nice and yeah i just had the best day with my bridesmaids or like two of my bridesmaids trying on dresses i'm very excited about the dress situation we found some really really good ones this week and i guess i'll update you on how we got on with that maybe in the next vlog yeah, i'm so excited there's just so much exciting stuff going on at the moment i'm so happy i feel like things are finally coming together i'm so happy like i just the girls being really sweet this week was just like I'm so, I just feel very, very grateful. That is where I'm gonna leave this vlog on a very, very happy note. So I will see you guys again on Sunday. Love you, bye.